Hey guys, Pam Brock here. Um, today I'm going to be working on a little bit of different video. I'm tired of doing the same old, same old. In fact, I've run out of ideas. <clears throat> today um, I've noticed online that there's not many videos on how to start crocheting. There's plenty of videos on how to crochet. They teach you how to crochet a chain stitch. They teach you how to crochet a double stitch. Um, Afghans, dish claws, they teach you everything. But they don't teach you how to start. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm here in Walmart and I have my mask. So let's put my mask on. And we're gonna learn how to start crocheting. All right, let's see if I can flip this camera around and not lose you guys. <clears throat> nope, <clears throat> I cannot. Let's see. Nope. <clears throat> so I've tried, I've started this video so many times today that I'm just not going to take chances on it. <clears throat> but I am in the little arts and crafts section, as you can see here at Walmart. <clears throat> um, and I've just run two ladies away by being on the camera, but that's okay. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> to start off with, you need what we call a needle, <clears throat> just a crocheting needle. Some people call it a crocheting hook, but it's what allows you to pull the thread into the different knots, because that's all crocheting is. Crocheting is a form of knot making. <clears throat> so, I'm going to stand up, because I'm in my scooter, and see, we're going to, I'm not going to buy any today, because my husband says I have four million chain um, crochet needles at home. So I'm just going to show you how to pick them out. <clears throat> As you can see, they, have, they do have um, crochet hook kits. This one here looks like it's got a book and it says, I taught myself to crochet. This one just got needles and a little carrying case. And down here, let me see, there they are. Um, <clears throat> those are the ones I was just talking about in case you didn't see them, because I can't see what you're looking at. <clears throat> but here's some individual hooks. They're just one hook by itself. And now they make the ergonomic hooks, and I really like them because used to, my fingers were hurt when I crochet. Um, so you kind of have to figure out what kind of crochet needle you want, how much you want to spend on it, <clears throat> and how your mask can fall down. Um, and then they have the, what I call the old fashioned, there it is, the old fashioned crochet hooks, except these are plastic. The old-fashioned crochet hooks were metal. Let me see, here they are. Here's one down here. <clears throat> there it is. It's metal. Um, it's aluminum. They give you the size on it and everything. I know it's backwards, <clears throat> but they do. They give you the size on it. So you'll know exactly what you're buying. <clears throat> um, let's see. We're gonna When we get home today, we're going to learn just how to crochet a basic chain stitch and I have the perfect crochet needle at home it's a size K now a K is kind of big this is a K and it says it's a 6.5 millimeter needle um, so that's kind of big but to start off with if you've never crocheted before you're gonna need something with a little bit of room because you're going to need to be able to have a bigger hook, a bigger crochet yarn than usual. <clears throat> so I've got that one at home. That's the one I'm going to give you instructions to go get if you're going to get anything. Is a K. That's to get started. <clears throat> and then I'll use the cake hook when we get home. Now, let's see what else have they got. This is just basic beginning. So what I've got at home is what we're going to use today. <clears throat> and this is the color <clears throat> that I've got at the house. It's peaches and cream. That's what Walmart sells here. They sell the peaches and cream in the big cone sizes. This is 100% cotton. Where's the sizes up? <clears throat> this is 100% cotton. The net weight's 14 ounces or 400 grams. There's 706 yards of this yarn in this cone, around this cone. And if you want to get something that's economical, this is it. <clears throat> then at home, I've also got these little things here. Oh, the big one, the big cone at Walmart is $8.44. Um, 
And I've got some of these little ones at the house. These are $1.77. These are just big enough for a couple of small things if that's what you're going to crochet. You're going to do good. Now this is stuff to start off with, okay? This is not big afghan material. This is not big bedroom size stuff. This is just the little stuff that you need to get started. So we're gonna stop for now and part two is coming up. I'll be at home and we'll learn how to chain stitch. Have a good day.